thank you very much. I'll be back again. My name is Naoto Takahashi. I'm a 24-year-old apprentice hairdresser. As a kid, I used to hate myself. That was when my mom took me to the hairdresser. The hairdresser, who cut my hair, cast a spell on me. Here is a spell for you to start liking yourself. I admired the hairdresser who changed me, and I decided to pursue the career myself. And now that I have the qualification, I'm training at this salon as an apprentice. Well, now that I've finished tidying up, maybe I'll start practicing cutting hair. After that, I'll study dyes. Sorry, we're closed now. Um... Wow, her clothes are really worn out. Her hair is all over the place, too. Is she all right? Um... Can you trim my bangs with this, please? Just your bangs? I don't have any more money. Uh... I'm still an apprentice hairdresser. Would you like to be my hair model? If you agree to be my hair model, I will cut your hair for free. Sure, I'll be your model. Hey, thanks for cooperating. And your name is? I'm Emery. How about you? My name is Naoto. Nice to meet you. This way, please. Okay. Less than an hour later. Is this really me? Wow! You're amazing! It's like you cast a magic spell over me! I feel like Cinderella! Don't worry, this magic won't come undone past midnight. It will last as long as you wish to stay beautiful. As long as I wish to stay beautiful? Beauty and cuteness can be created. You can change yourself by being inspired and introspective. Alright, we are all done! Thank you! Next time I come, I'll be sure to save up money. When I come back, will you cut my hair again? I'll be here for you anytime, Miss Cinderella. <laughs> Thank you so much. But the little Cinderella never returned after that. I could tell based on her appearance that there was a lot going on in her life. It was a little sad, but I wished her all the best as I practiced day after day. Eight years later. Thanks a lot. Thank you! I'll be back again! I'll be here! I finished five years of apprenticeship and became an independent salon owner three years ago. At my hair salon, I have been working hard to make my customers happy. In this area, there used to be no other hair salons, so all the locals came to my salon. But recently, other salons opened their doors in the vicinity. Large chain hair salons are rapidly expanding, and because of that, smaller, individually owned salons are struggling. Another tough month, huh? I need to come up with a strategy to compete against the other salons. Uh, but how do I do that? Business strategy is outside my area of expertise. Hello? Excuse me, can I please get a shampoo done? Yes, of course. This way, please. Thank you so much. She's really pretty. Is she a model? I don't recognize her from the Japanese model industry. I'm not too up to date on models in other countries. Less than an hour later. Thank you, it felt amazing. Here you go. 130 yen? Oh my gosh, are you that girl? <laughs> you didn't recognize me, did you? It's been a while, Naoto. I didn't expect you to visit. You were the first person I wanted to visit when I came back to Japan. So, I contacted that hair salon to ask and they gave me the information about this place. Back in Japan? So you're living abroad now? Yeah. At the time I first met you, my dad's company was not doing well. That's why we were living in poverty. But... Then there were opportunities abroad and we ended up immigrating to the United States. My dad was a huge success there and his company got back on track. Oh, I'm so glad to hear that. Yeah. Things settled down so I came back to Japan. And your parents? They're still in the States. So, are you living by yourself in Japan? That was the plan, but I haven't found a place yet. So, I have a favor to ask you. Can I stay with you? Sorry, what? 
I also want to repay the favor from eight years ago. I'll take care of you too, please? Even then, I don't know if you should stay with me. At this rate, I'll be camping out on the streets. Uh. I wonder what would happen if such a cute person like me ended up sleeping outside. Uh. Oh, something bad might happen to me. All right, fine. You can stay with me, but only temporarily until you find a place to rent. Okay. And so began my new life living with a beautiful woman. The next morning. Wake up! Wake up, Naoto! It's my day off. Five more minutes. Oh, come on. You can't do that. If you're not going to wake up, I'm going to do this. Hmm? What's going on? It's so warm. Ooh. Uh, what in the world? What do you mean, what? You're not waking up, so I'm snuggling with you. No need to snuggle. I want you to get to know my love language. You're too close, and you're not making any sense. Here, get out. Aww. Now, Toe, you're so mean. I'm not being mean. The heck is with this intimacy? Is this normal in the States? A few hours later. What are you doing? Sitting. On my lap? I thought I'd comfort you with my presence. Isn't it comforting to have a cute girl so close to you? You're too close! I'm okay being close to you, Naoto. I'm not okay with it! Wouldn't it be more helpful to practice on a real person? Yeah, you're right. I can't get feedback from a mannequin. Why don't you practice on me? Are you sure? Head massage practice? It must feel really nice. Sign me up! If you say so, thanks. After that, I took advantage of Emery's offer and practiced styling her hair too. Ugh, now tell you're seriously the best. Mmm, not my best. I still want to get better. That way, I can compete against the big chain salons. You're a hard worker. Hard work and improving is the only option. Putting in consistent effort is amazing. It's part of talent. And I know you'll be okay, Naoto. Because you are the person who made me smile with some of your magic. Happiness will come to those who bring joy to others. So don't be too discouraged. Keep going! Emiri... Thanks. I'll work even harder. I'll give you a treat if you work hard. Just like this. I think I'm good. Is that not good enough for you? Well then, how about a kiss? I don't need kisses either. And so began my days with Emery. She started helping out at the shop and her presence alone was enough to brighten up the salon. And thanks to her, the number of customers increased. Every day with Emery was filled with joy and happiness, but it didn't last forever. Thanks for another great day! It's fun working at a hair salon. Should I apply to get a job here permanently? Or maybe I'll just apply to be your wife. That's enough joking around. Uh, let's clean up. Okay! Sorry, we're closed already. There she is. Get her! What are you guys doing? Ugh, what is this guy? Get away from Emery! Naoto! Run, Emery! Hurry! Bye! Don't worry about me! Go! Hold on. Sir! Sir? Didn't think you'd be in a place like this, Emery. We searched for you everywhere. What's this? What's going on? Searched everywhere? Emery is not as well known here in Japan. In the States, she is a famous supermodel. You'll see what I mean when you see this. Is this Emery? I don't blame you for not knowing her. There's a difference in her popularity and fame between different countries. Emery, what is all this? I... She suddenly disappeared. She abandoned all responsibilities and ran away. But you won't be able to get away with any more of this, Emery. But I... Your career isn't a game. 
Do you realize how much trouble and heartache you caused other people? That... If you understand, gather your belongings and come with us. But... Um, I'm sure Emery is overwhelmed by this sudden turn of events. Can you give her an extra day to prepare? Very well. We don't want her to take off running again. You have one day. We will give you the entire day tomorrow to pack and prepare. We will be back to pick you up the day after tomorrow. I... I understand. A few minutes later. So, can you explain all this? I thought you came back to Japan because things settled down. Well... After you transformed me that day, I had a newfound passion for beauty. Beauty and cuteness can be created. Your words became words of encouragement for me. I started researching and studying how to be cuter and how to be prettier. I especially became interested in clothes that would make me more beautiful. So, I started making my own clothes because buying was tough financially. I wanted to share my creation with others, so I modeled the clothes and started posting on social media. That was when the CEO of my current agency scouted me. Modeling was very enjoyable, and I became successful while enjoying my career. But the more famous I became, the more I lost my freedom. Making my own clothes was out of the question. All I wanted to do was be the prettiest version of myself while having fun. But everything took a turn after I became successful. I hated it. So I abandoned everything and ran away. I don't want to go back. Help me, Naoto. That I can't do. Naoto? It's tough to have less freedom, I understand. It's inevitable to struggle between your ideal life and reality. There's days when it's hard to breathe. But that does not justify abandoning all responsibilities and running away. But... but... Have you thought about the people who are sad because you left? Huh? Your fans must be heartbroken after hearing the news of your disappearance. And I am sure that the CEO of your agency is going around apologizing to lots of people. There's consequences when you abandon responsibilities. You know that, right? Uh, Emery, do you dislike your career as a model? I don't dislike it. Wearing lots of clothes, applying makeup and having my hair done. I love being in the spotlight. But I don't want to lose my freedom. Have you communicated that with the CEO? Uh-huh. You need to put your feelings into words. Try communicating it. I'm sure he'll understand. Okay. I'll try. I'll try to express myself to the CEO. That a girl? In order to do that, Naoto, can you cast a spell on me? A spell for me to have courage. Of course. What is your wish, Cinderella? Can you do my hair so I look beautiful? As you wish. Less than an hour later. There we go. Oh my gosh! This hairstyle is beautiful! I thought it would look good on you, Emery. <laughs> Thank you, Naoto. I will speak my truth. You can do it. The next day. Emery. I apologize for causing so much trouble, but I've already made up my mind. From this day onwards, I will show up as the renewed version of myself. And I am no longer a puppet. I will change my hairstyle as I please, and I will wear clothes that I want to wear. I will show everyone what I'm made of. That's not going to work. All right. If you are so determined, I will support you to the best of my abilities. What? Look at her determination. You can see it in her eyes. She will be fine. I'm sorry for everything. Going forward, I will promise to respect your opinion. What great news! Emery doesn't need to give up modeling or her freedom! Thank you so much! Oh, and I have one more request. What is it? Well... Three years have passed since then. My salon has become very popular amongst the locals here. Many of the customers choose us over the chain beauty salons. 
Did you know? Supermodel and designer Emily won a global fashion award? Not surprised. She's a genius that makes Japan proud. I wonder where someone like her gets a haircut. If I remember correctly, she's back in Japan now, right? Imagine if she was getting her hair cut at her local hair salon. Yeah, right. Hello, darling. Your Cinderella is home. Make me beautiful again, please. Emery, I'm helping other customers right now. Oops, sorry. Huh? That's Emily. Is this a dream? Not a dream. I'm Emery, the supermodel and designer. It's the real deal! This is reality! <laughs> Emery and I fell in love and we got married. Whenever she is in Japan for an extended amount of time, she comes home like this. Thanks to the understanding and compassionate CEO, she is free to do what she wants. Darling, how much longer? I'll cast a spell on you in a bit, so be patient, okay? Okay. She might have become world-renowned, but her personality hasn't changed. She is still the same sweet and spoiled girl, and I am the only one who can cast a spell on her, always and forever. Hi, it's me, Mel. Thanks for watching my channel. I'm super happy if you watch the next and other videos too.